Okay, I checked here for uh, the crack to see how much further it went. And I've done this twice now and all we get is the same thing. It used to be, I thought it cut across about a half inch, but it's not showing that here. So this is what it looks like right now. Go ahead and wipe this crap off of here. see it better so you can see where that crack goes across right there and ends the one going down the cylinder is not a crack so I'm going to go ahead and center punch the end of that crack so I'll be able to hit it with a drill and then we'll start plugging up the side of the cylinder like we did on the other side all right I marked where the crack was and then I went down a little bit lower because I think I see a little bit more of a crack, but it's hard to tell. Anyway, I center punched it. The punch drops a little bit lower than I want it to be, but it's close. So I'm going to drill holes in here and try to do this and see how it looks when I'm doing. Okay, I made up this little tool right here to support the drill. It's an aluminum tube. About seven inches long. When you drill through here, you, you support the drill, and you drill over here where you want to drill at. So there's our hole over there. So that's what that looks like. And we get back to our hole here. Camera shut off. You can see how thin this hole is in here. Very, very thin. I was figuring it's going to be a yeah, about 316 stick and you can see back in there some kind of a cavity um, I'm not sure if we're even uh, an eighth inch thick in there it's pretty thin so I'm gonna have to use a different style pin than I was thinking of using so you can see where the crack kind of comes in uh, above it there a little bit so my next hole is going to be slightly above this hole so we go ahead and tap this and continue on trying to pin this thing so we're going to use our tapered pins on this one instead of the uh, the other style. So here's the different pins are laying here. These ones here are the tapered ones. There we go. So we've got the tapered one on the right. And this one here has a shoulder on it that you put recessed in a cylinder wall, but you can see how there's going to be nowhere near I can do that because there's no material to do that with. So I've got to use this taper one like we used on the inside of the port. Let it bottom out against this taper and leave it at that. So that's what we're going to do. All right, I used my long center drill here to go in here and uh, lightly chamfer this hole right here. Not chamfer, yeah. A little counter cut up on that because the pin's going at a heavy angle, so it cuts up on the top of the hole there, not too much in the bottom. So it gives a little bit of room for that pin to go in there at an angle. At least that's the theory. So I'll go ahead and tap this and then we'll put a pin in it. See what it looks like. There's our first pin in there. Dark in here. So Went in there pretty good. It's bottomed out real nice up in there. Come on, focus. Work. So, I'm going to go ahead and put the hole right above it. And get up there where that red marker is there. I think you can see the crack just above the top of that red line is where the crack is, it looks like. So, we're going to drill it right in that spot. Put another plug in there. I got three pins in here now. So <clears throat> you can see how it's following the crack there. There's a good picture of it. So I'm just following the crack right up the hole, right up the line there. They're kind of a pain in the buck at the heavy angle we're putting them in there at, but they're looking good. Hopefully there's nothing down below this area that's a crack. 
There's a scratch going across there, I can see, but don't see no more crack. Hopefully it's nothing else. It comes in. The cylinder's getting a little bit thicker here up further we're going up, but it's still pretty thin. So anyway, we're gonna continue on this and when I get up a little bit higher the camera will be able to see it when I when I got it set back here in the corner. So we'll just continue. <laughs> 